yeah, it's been... It's been a little bit. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Halloween Happy, where Halloween is more than just once a year because it's a lifestyle. Maybe we'll just, I don't know what we're doing. We're just gonna jump into it. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Halloween Happy, where Halloween is more than just once a year. It's our thing. It's our jam. Hi guys, I've missed you so much. I can't even believe I'm filming a video. Um, I had just posted on my social media. If you don't follow me, check me out. It's Halloween Happy. Um, all my links are listed down below. I've missed you. I hope you all are doing well. I hope you're keeping safe. I hope you're keeping healthy i hope you're continuing to love one another i just hope you guys are hanging in there and i really hope you're doing okay because i know <laughs> so this video is going to be about grandin road um if you did not i need to screen record don't i with things with corona like you guys know halloween shopping is my thing like i'm obsessed and I'm not saying like go risk your life to go get the Halloween stuff. It's your life. You, you're you responsible for your own self. But if you do go out shopping, wear your mask, social distance yourself. Like don't be a jerk. Don't run Halloween for us, okay? But then I just don't want other people thinking that I'm inconsiderate of their health too. So I try to like keep my distance and let them know like, hey, I respect your health. Can you respect my health? Just be careful. I don't know what your guys' state is. I don't know what's going on with your state as far as open for biz. But here in Massachusetts, here in Salem, we're like behind. We're slow, which I'm fine with. I don't know. I feel like I'm going to want to make a few of these videos. Just doing some online Halloween shopping. I hope you guys don't mind. We're going to see. We're just, I'm going for it. I'm just not going to worry about you know, all of my insecurities and my self-doubts. Um, but anyways, I rambled on for 10 minutes. Disgusting. This video, we are going to be looking at Halloween Haven by Grandin Road. And if you guys are not aware of Grandin Road, I learned about them like a long time ago with their Halloween Haven. This is back in the day when Halloween was not a known thing to be like a lifestyle like it is today and I would always request their catalogs for Halloween Haven just so I could collect the magazines. I still have my old issues um, and I would shop to get some things for my Halloween parties and I just really liked it because Martha Stewart used to have a line with Halloween Haven. Um, she doesn't anymore. Every year they do these Halloween videos that I absolutely just I die for. My dream has been to like I just want to do Halloween. I would love to do scene setting for them and help them shoot their video and decorate it for and just like set up the scene and stuff. Like that's always been my dream. Every video, every year that they do, I can just, I can see myself on set with them, you know? And I will say, I know that some people, if you're unfamiliar with Halloween Haven, it is pricey. It's pricey, but it's definitely like more of the upscale Halloween. Like it's not your big lots Halloween. As of now, I haven't seen anyone really post about it. So I was like, well, let me make this video. We can kind of look at it together. So I'm going to stop rambling and we are going to go ahead and um, look at this. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and pop up the screen over here. Let me try to scoot over. So go ahead and go to Halloween Haven. And I will say definitely check them out after Halloween season because they do put stuff on sale. Wait a little bit after just to kind of see. Even December check, even January. I remember one time I got this Martha Stewart huge pumpkin. I've never showed it really. I think just in one of my old apartment tours. Oh, it's my favorite thing. It's like this huge pumpkin, but it's like a pumpkin bowl. I've used it for party drinks for my Halloween parties. Currently right now I have all of my Halloween blankets in it and it's just, it's the best thing ever. I also got this big jack-o'-lantern clock from them on sale. So you know, you just gotta keep checking back. They have all sorts of Halloween stuff, you guys. As you can see, you get the traditional Halloween. You also get like glam Halloween, witches, wreaths, greenery, lights. Like, ugh, the lighted decor is my favorite from them, especially the out 
the outside displays like oh it's to die for i love their entertaining stuff they have some really cute like costumes and accessories you already got my email grand name road let's go ahead and look at new halloween arrivals life-size chilling Chantel. Here's like the upscale stuff I was telling you about. I automatically always go towards, there's just so many things. These 31 block numbers are $79. Like you'll see when you look. These block letters are $79. Um, I love this raven platter. That's cute. And I'm just gonna scroll through because I don't want this video to be too long because I know that you guys are gonna go to the website anyways to check it out for yourself because it's gonna be so much fun. Just kind of wanted, I don't know, I guess show my reaction. Uh, that Marvelous Witch Moon wreath is really cute. Ooh, look at that vampire one. Oh, how beautiful is this? Wow, there's so much detail on that. I'm shocked. Whoa, oh my gosh. $360, guys. This is probably made by... Who's the maker? I mean, it's handcrafted, obviously, so. Support your spooky artist, right? This vampire moon one is nice. Okay, so I go for, I always like looking at, I don't even have a yard, so what's the point right now, since I'm in an apartment? I really love these pre-lit Halloween lanterns. I bet you it's only one that you get for 99. I miss having a yard and a house to decorate and to have Halloween parties. Like, I don't know. You know how, like, sometimes I'm always like, there's something missing. Something's not right. Like, there's a few things I know that's not right right now in my life, but one of those things is I really miss hosting a Halloween party. Like, honestly, this sounds really dramatic, but it just gave me life, and it was the one thing I looked forward to every year. I was known as the Halloween party girl, you know? See, I love stuff like that. Well, it's pointless now because I don't have Halloween parties, um, but this one, this Raven 3-tiered server is $250. Ooh, look at this ghostly graveyard wreath. This is beautiful. $159. Is this handmade? I mean, this would be a beautiful HIY. This would be beautiful for spring. This would be beautiful for Christmas. And you can add some red to it, some silver. Oh, be good for Valoween. Or this ghostly graveyard is a theme. Oh, that garland is to die for on the fireplace. Oh man, look at this forest face wreath. That's beautiful. Dragon tail yard display, that's fun. I feel like right now the sneak peek is to all of the expensive stuff. Which I get, I get, I get. Guys, I'm so excited and then also I know at home is putting out Halloween as well. I'm hoping maybe we can take a trip this weekend. I don't know, if you're going Halloween shopping, be careful, wear your mask, sanitize, wash your hands, don't touch your face, be respectful of everyone's health and space. Um, we did go thrifting a few days ago because I just, I wanted to go, I had to go. I was safe about it. I know that Corona is still a thing. Um, I'm like choosing wisely I'm choosing wisely on uh, what I want to risk my life for. Let me know if you guys will be going out. What else do we got? I feel like I want to see. Looking at this stuff honestly makes me think of my mom. What else do we have? Let's look at entertaining. Oh, okay. So we don't have anything there. Okay, that's fine. So here's the sneak peek. Okay, so we have, can you guys, I hope you guys can see. So we have this 31 block numbers. It's cute, but for $79, that is really pricey. Think of all the Halloween stuff we could buy for the cost of that. Over here, we have a tombstone with melting candles. That would look amazing. I just want to live like in a woodsy area and have a Halloween party every single night. So out of the sneak peeks, Nothing that I really need to order just yet. I'm gonna wait, obviously, because this is just a sneak peek. Relax, Sam. But these would be so cute in my office or like inside the house. I love these pre-lit witch hats. You get a set of three for $130. That's uh, crazy, because I feel like you could HIY these. Who am I to judge? Uh, let's see, I really like this Halloween husk wreath. That's cute. 
Oh man, I love that garland. That's really cute. It's kind of like um, the Christmas tree material. What is that called? Tinsel? What is that called? The garland. Ooh, it's cordless though. Oh, it lights up. Oh, look at how cute that is. I don't know. I feel like that's what I would want. How long is it? Let's see. $80, six feet. Okay, actually, that I don't think that's bad because when you think about it, there are some garland pieces that I've gotten from Michaels that are normally like $40 to $50. Sometimes they're not, they don't have lights on them. This one looks really plush. Um, I'm sure they've like fanned it out to make it look really beautiful for these photos, but I really love this. This is, I really like this. Just like stuff that you can build on. That's the kind of Halloween stuff I like. Probably don't have any costumes yet. I've always wanted this, you guys. Like every year I see it online and I always want it. This one's a little different though. Like in every video that they've done for each year, they always have like the people wearing these and their makeup's done and their nails are spooky. It's just so cute effortlessly chic an instant costume um but yeah i'm excited to see like what they're gonna have for pillows like placemats more of the more of the food like dishes and stuff like that this like this is the time that i'm obsessed with halloween like like i like coasting to halloween i like the road to halloween you know i always <laughs> Every year I see these eyeball orbs and I just think they're the coolest thing. I know you can make them, but sometimes there's just some things I don't want to make. I actually have this corner spider web. I got this from Spirit Halloween um, when I did like a decorating video for them on my channel. Oh, I love this metal cauldron on a stand. You could do so much with that. You can make it into a prop. Love that. Okay, see this? can get at Big Lots for cheaper. Man, I just cannot wait. Bernard the butler, he's always a classic. He makes an appearance every year. I love these felt bats. These are really cute. Oh my gosh, I just spotted this sign. I remember this last year. Do you guys remember this sign? The palm reader one? It's only a hundred dollars. I feel like that's a a good deal for it to be a neon lighted sign, especially from Grandin Road. Oh, I just love it. They do all sorts of little scene setups for most of their decor of how they set it up just to give you ideas. But my favorite thing of what they do is they shoot videos like this for most of the scenes. So my favorite thing is just to go on there and watch the videos over and like the music and the sound effects and oh, it just, I love it so much. You know, sometimes like people ask me, do you get sick of Halloween because you celebrate it every day? I don't get sick of it. It's just, it's not like, I don't know. For some people who just only decorate once a year, like I feel like it's more exciting for them because they've missed it so much. Whereas I surround myself with it all the time. But looking at stuff like this gets me so excited. Let me look at this. See, I'm a sucker for garland. You guys know that. Oh, this is cute. I don't think this is new. Look at that garland. Isn't that cute? That's really cute. Okay, so it's $40. Glows with 50 warm white micro lights. Battery operated is always a plus. I don't know, I might have to get this honestly. It's $40. Uh, let's see the dimensions. I really like that. I love that the spiders are on it. I love that. It All right guys, sorry my camera shut off and I just kept rambling. I don't know where I left off at, but I was looking at this twig broomstick. I was saying I like buying the decor that you can build on and you can use for different themes. Um, but I really love this twig broomstick. I already have a few brooms, but I love this one. Um, and I'm honestly really surprised that it's only $19. But with this, you can hang it on a wall. You can hang it vertically. You can hang it horizontal, like above a fireplace. You can have it leaning on something. 
You can tie some ribbon to it, some Halloween ribbon, add some string lights to it, put some Halloween charms on it. So many options. I'm really excited. Um, you can also, let me do this real quick because you have to do this every year. Let me request a catalog so I can get my Halloween Haven catalog. Okay, I'll do that so you guys can see my private information. Definitely do that because they'll send you the Halloween Haven catalog. I feel like there's been a few times where I'll sign up and they send just the normal one and then the Halloween Haven one will come out a little bit closer to October. But there's a fall one that they do too, so... I don't know, if you like collecting magazines and stuff like I do, uh, definitely sign up for it and check the sale after Halloween because I promise it's worth it. I'll have to show you guys some of the stuff I've gotten from Grandin Road. They're honestly like one of my favorite, a few of my favorite pieces in my collection. Um, I don't know, just because I think that's when I was like starting my Halloween parties, so I have fond memories of the items and I'm attached to them. That's gonna be our little, uh, I don't even know what this video is gonna be called. It's gonna be our little Grandin Road Halloween Haven reaction video, a little walkthrough, I guess, for the sneak peek. Definitely keep an eye out for you guys, but let me know what you think. Let me know if you've ever shopped from Grandin Road. I know it's pretty pricey, um, but some things on there are definitely worth it. Just depends like what your taste is, depends what you're looking for. If you wanna follow me on social media, guys, I am on Instagram, it's Halloween Happy, and I also have a Facebook page. We are so close to 15,000 subscribers on my YouTube on my YouTube channel. So if you are new, maybe this is your first time seeing my video, hi, we do celebrate Halloween here. Every single day I just create Halloween content all throughout the year, so I hope you can click that subscribe button and stick around and meet all the other Halloween happy friends. Say, oh yeah, and check out my Facebook page. We're almost at 60,000 followers over there, which is insane. If you like this video and if you're excited for Halloween, Halloween shopping, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. I miss you guys so much. I hope you're all doing well. Thank you to everyone who's messaged me over the past few months. Has it really been a few months since I've made a new video? I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't even want to look. I did do a poll on if we want to do the mail videos or if we should do it live. A lot of you guys said do mail videos. So those will be coming too. I have a few hauls that I need to film upload to my channel. So stay tuned for that. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. Um, I appreciate you being here and just hanging out with me for a little bit. I love you guys so much. I hope this video finds you having a Halloween happy kind of day and I will see you guys next time. Bye.